Hi guys, I'm Antonios, Antonios Vizentinis from Fodio Road, Greece and in this video we will uh, make the, the splash activity basically uh, what, uh, what we want this activity to do is just load up an, uh, a splash screen for uh, some seconds, for 5 seconds let's say and then uh, kill itself and open a new activity. The new activity it will be uh, the menu activity. So, for this reason, we will use uh, a thread. A thread allows you to, to do one or multiple uh, things at the same time. And it's very important to game development. So, we have to set up our thread now. The name of the thread we can name it uh, time the time vi uh, variable it will be equals to new thread open and close the parenthesis and now we have to open bracket click enter and uh, in this bracket we have to type a question mark so the thread to close the thread in the thread we must we must use a method called the run so we will write this method public void run open close the parenthesis and then we open the bracket click enter and we have the method run what we will do in uh, this method we will try to, to slip the, this activity for some uh, time and then we will try to, to catch any error that uh, will be in our thread and finally we will make an ident so we can uh, open uh, the new activity that we want so first we start with the try, open bracket, click enter, and in uh, and in here we we'll write a method called slip. We want to slip this activity for uh, let's say one thousand millisecond, with which it is uh, one second. So if we want five seconds, we have to write five thousand milliseconds. Question mark. And then, if this is that doesn't work, we have to cut the exception, interrupted exception. So you we use the key cuts. Open the parenthesis. In the parenthesis, uh, we will write the uh, the error that we want to check interrupted exception control space so we eclipse help us this is it then we use a variable we we'll call it e open the bracket enter and here we will uh, use the e variable in the print stack trace So we can see the error who probably will be. Finally, we open the bracket, click enter. Finally, we want an ident. An ident a variable a. So then would be equal to new ident. In this activity, activity is plus dot this, and the activity that we want to open is the menu activity. So right menu. Clips try to help us. That's it. And then 
we have to start the activity. Start a control space. We take this and we want uh, to start the activity A. See, the ident A contains the activity menu class. That's it. We have a mistake here. That's the name of our uh, activity, this one. And now we want to start the thread. Our thread variable is time dot uh, start. Question mark. And I think we are ready. We set up our thread uh, variable with name uh, time. We make a new method. Uh, run. We try to slip this activity for five seconds. We check for any errors and finally when this finished we make an indent for menu class and start the activity A to go to this uh, to open this uh, activity, menu activity. And then after the question mark we set time to start. We set the thread time to start. That's it. So we want this uh, when uh, try to start the activity menu class we want this uh, activity to, to finish. We want this activity to destroy itself. Uh, for that reason, we have to use uh, the onPass on method, which is from uh, activity superclass, control space. This is the onPass method. Double click it. And here we use the word finish, control space. This is it question mark and we are ready. And with this one, when the activity menu class starts, this will be on pass and finish destroy the activity. So we can uh, use it anymore. That's it. Now we have we can uh, try to run it and see what will happen. My emulator is already running. We click uh, we right click on uh, the name of our project and then run as Android application and we wait to see what will happen. Yes, we didn't save any the change that we make. Save it. And we, we wait to see the application running. That's it guys. Uh, we wait uh, for a few seconds and now the main menu is uh, open. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching this video and uh, have a nice day.